Welcome to On The Beat, everyone. I'm over here with the man behind the bars, Dr. Griffin from Griffin Centre for Cosmetic Surgery. And today we're talking all about rhinoplasty. Welcome to the show, my friend. Okay, Sorry. this is one of my favourite topics. I like that we're in a day and age, Dr. Griffin, that the stigma has gone from people having cosmetic or plastic surgery. Definitely. Don't you agree? Totally. And if you're feeling a little uncomfortable about a part of your body, it's no big taboo anymore. So let's talk about rhinoplasty. Sure. What is it? Rhinoplasty is a procedure where we reconstruct the nose mm -hmm. or make desirable changes for a patient. It can be reconstruction from cancer surgery, trauma, or someone just wants to shake their nose differently. Okay, we're going to bring up a picture of you drawing on someone's nose sure. and we want you to explain what that is. Now, is that part of the consultation? Yes, we, we you know, do a thorough examination yes. and determine, because the nose is made of bone and cartilage and, and we want to determine what we're going to do to the different structures. Mm. And then I do some imaging computer imaging to determine what the nose is going to look like afterwards. That gives, and I discuss that with the patient, it gives me a better idea of what the patient is desiring. Okay, now I'm going to touch on some medical reasons why you would probably do it or just purely cosmetic. What are some of the medical reasons that you would have rhinoplasty? And is there any? Yes, there are. Like I was saying, uh, trauma. Sometimes the nose is so destroyed that I have to take an outer cortex of cranial bone to yes. reconstruct it. Uh, sometimes it's cancer reconstruction where you rotate a flap from the forehead down. And then there cleft lip and palate, mm -hmm. build the nose up. And then there's just the changing the structure. Well, maybe you want to have the bump well, taken away. Exactly. Or slim line the nose. Exactly. But I was also thinking, is it anything to do with like people with bad sinuses, breathing issues, or is that it, really not the case? That's not so much the case. If it's a uh, structural deviated septum and so forth, I work with the ear, nose, and throat doctors. They're right. the specialists okay. in that. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about downtime because it is quite a complex surgery, like you said, are people needing a week away from work, two weeks? Because there's a little bit of bruising, right? Yeah, I would, exactly. I would say a week because we have a splint on mm -hmm. the nose externally and we always tend to get bruising around the uh, eyes. Okay. I, would, I, I think a week the splint comes off, the stitches come out, and the only external scar or incision line is a real small one right here, right. and that's it. Okay, we're going to bring up some before and after pictures sure. of one of your patients. Now, just explain what we're looking at as the before. This patient came to me because she had a very ethnic nose, Yes. and she is a very, uh, as you can see, slender face person, and the nose just overpowered her face. Yeah. So with her, I reduced the, the projection of the nose, I narrowed her nose a little more and changed some of the cartilages to give some refinement to well, the Well, let's tip. look at the after shot as well because it truly is quite a big difference. It she must have been over the moon. It, it, it <laughs> makes people really feel good, yes. Yeah, and don't you feel that it's a confidence booster? 100%. Yeah. Absolutely. Is that part of the thing that you like doing? That's the like thing. that's part of the gig that just gets your boat Troy. That's rolling. the thing I love yeah. is seeing patients and thinking that I had some small part of making their life better. I it's, hear you, it Dr. just Griffin. really makes me feel. You're good. amazing. We appreciate you well, coming thank in you. just again. Thank you. If you want to find out more information about Dr. Griffin and Griffin Center for Cosmetic Surgery, they have an incredible team over there. Everyone, give them a call. Go in for a consultation. You never know what is possible back after this short break how easy is that you make it easy stay there i'm going to take a picture with you nancy can we